What's up everybody, I am Pizuka and in this episode we are going to go over how you can have your emoji, video, gif or whatever you fancy with sound pop up on screen on your Twitch stream. Just as you could do right here if I go to uh, my channel points and I redeem something called Stop Dying, get this. You have failed this city. Simple. You can have image, emoji, whatever you want pop up and have a sound of your choice pop up on screen. You can also have it by command, explanation mark, like stop dying, you would get this. Or for example, I have uh, the whoop whoop. This one. And then I have the almighty rip as well, of course. But today we are going to make the fourth command for my channel and I'm going to walk you through how it's done while I do it, so stay tuned. So for this we use this program, Trigger Fire. It's an awesome program that's online, but it uses a widget for stream elements. What you do is you go to overlays.thefirewire.com forward slash widgets forward slash trigger fire. I will leave the link in the description below. You log in with your Twitch account. I've already done that. It's quite simple. I can show you here how that's done right here in the top corner. And when you're in there, you get a link to their discord. Go to this link and open up, that opens up the Spaghetti Central Discord server. Go to Trigger Fire Beta and press here, Welcome to the Trigger Fire Open Beta Expand Me. Here is the both a link to the Firewire uh, dashboard that I have here and a link for the widget to put it into your stream elements. I've already done that, but basically what you got to do is press this, log into your stream elements and you can leave widgets through that. Quite simple. When you're done that, what you need to do, make your own. I have my three, like, uh, full res emojis that I have on my channel, also as a pop up that people can redeem, in my case, for channel points. But you can also do that, like I said, with the uh, commands. What I do to make a new one is go here down to the top, uh, the bottom right corner press the plus sign and if you want only to use commands you can do the command here you can for example say because we're gonna make a new one here now we're gonna say gg make the gg one or gg beats Zuka, whatever you want to do okay i'm gonna just leave it as a gg we're gonna make a gg emoji pop up on that screen but because i use it as a channel point redeemable item i go to this icon over here and i say that my command is going to be for the channel points but the name of the reward if i want to allow both i can check this here then it works for both redeeming the channel points and for commands but i only want to use the channel points in my case so press save I have the user level on everyone the user cooldown will be 60 seconds the global cooldown will be 30 seconds, so people don't spam it constantly and ruin the show, of course. If people would, would want to do that. Next up, you go to select emits. I need to upload my new emits. Full res. Boss baby GG. Select that. Select it. The, uh, this. This is the full size of it. The duration is going to be the around... Just think about it this way, if you have a sound effect, you want to have the same duration for your image as for the sound effect itself. The sound effect I made for this, well I got for this, is 10 seconds long. Position, we're going to select, in, you can select it here, random position or whatever you want, but we're going to do that more in the stream elements part later on. What we do next is we add the sound effects if you want to use it. Do that by pressing here, attach sound, it's optional. Uh, I use sounds mostly from myinstance.com. I'm using this sound over here, you get loads of sounds you can choose from. But what you gotta 
worry about, uh, think about is that the sounds here are very loud. So what I do, I took this sound for example, it's very very loud, I need to lower this volume down here to show you. And his name is John C. And I took that sound and I put that into the DaVinci Resolve. I put some limiters on it, I put some uh, adjustments to it, there we go. And I made it so it's clearer, it's uh, not as loud and it's just even and short. I just realized it's not 10 seconds, it's 13 seconds, it's a little bit long. But we're gonna make that do for now and this video I might edit that later on for my live version. We're gonna make this 13 seconds here. Well, actually, we can make that 10 seconds and the volume just fades out at the end. So we press the attach sound button over here. Go to upload, select your file and upload it. Preferably in MP3 format. I already uploaded mine over here. And uh, you can adjust the volume as well in here. But if you edit it like I did, maybe just put it down a lot, about 90% because mine is at the max uh, possible. And you can always adjust that later on. Go over to advanced and control this a little bit over here as well. But uh, for now, this is more advanced users. I haven't even used this. So this will do for now. I just press save on this. And we let that work out. And then that this is ready. What we do now, what you need to do now, go so make that command in your dashboard you go to your channel points system here under community channel points and then i go and add new custom reward that's going to be named gg i named it gg in small lower case i'm gonna make that cost 555 daggers which is the channel points we use and i say here uh, gg it's uh the description and then what I do you can set your own like icon stuff like that I'm not gonna do that right now have this aim something color maybe Keep it green Dark green this this is that and just hit create. Then we have created this here. It cost us 555 channel points redeem. Time. You can of course decide how much it's gonna cost for you. When that's all done, what you gotta do is go at the widget to your stream elements account. You press this link over here, it'll open up your stream elements at that widget. And you should have something like this: trigger fire by the Firewire Beta version 281 in my case. And you can go here and preview it, you can edit it, all that stuff. And uh, what I basically did to edit, I just selected the location I want the pop-ups to be in. And then I edited a little bit of the animation enter and exit options, fade in and fade out, animation duration and stuff like that. Image trigger options after you change a lot of options here. Mess about with those as much as you want. And the widget token, this is what you use to set up the connection between this and your stream elements. Go to your profile picture here, you go to settings, this is the token, you just copy this, go over to your stream elements, insert your token over here. Then you have connected these two parts together and everything should work nicely. Press save. When that's done, you go to the copy, you were, uh, copy overlay URL. And you go over to your OBS to uh, go to sources, press the plus icon, browser, create new, rename that like I did here, emotes on screen, whatever you want to create, blah, blah, blah. Press OK, put this over here, the resolution, always make that same resolution as your streaming resolution is, like mine 920 times 1080, OK. And it should pop up over here. And just to show you, I'm going to keep this open here. 
and you go to your channel points you find the GG which is down here you press redeem and it should pop up this is what your viewers do pop up right here and his name is John C. Easy peasy. Just to show you how it looks, like for example on your chat screen, someone says GG when you're playing a game or chatting or whatever. It works also there. And his name is John C. Very nice. Yes, this is how it's done. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for watching i'm live on fits every wednesday friday and sunday from 9 p.m gmt you can find me there playing some random fps games or just random other games it depends on the mood i also sometimes make emojis and other stuff check it out don't forget to hit that subscribe button that follow bell and that thumbs up comment down below if you have any questions about this process as always peace out and have a nice day